Good morning and welcome to Shorty's. This is where we do a lot of our planning and scheduling and things we need to do to keep ourselves organized to shoot our music concerts. Sometimes a lot of people just think that, that shooting concerts is all done at the concert venue. But a lot of times it's done in places like this where you have peace and quiet, time to think, and to organize. I keep a journal of things to keep my thoughts in order. Some of the things I'd like to do, some of the things like people who are, we want to photograph and who we want to see, venue information, times and dates and a calendar are all stored in notebooks, online, and in areas where we can get to them rather quickly so we can make adjustments. So this is what he does is to decide who he wants to see, who he wants to tape, who he wants to shoot, and then we figure out the ones that we want to see this year. Um, Caitlin Butts. Let's see, I got Sunny Sweeney. Um, I want to see the ra uh, Raised Right Man. Remember that Alan guy that I wanted to see? Alan. Mm -hmm. No, not Alan. I don't remember his name now. Um, um, I'd like to see. Um, Flatland Cavalry. Whiskey Myers. <gasps> yeah. Whiskey Myers. Um, and uh, I'm thinking of people you'd like to see over again. So what we do when we make out our list of everybody we want to see, we go out and check out their venues, the, check out their websites to see what venues are going to be that are in our area and what dates and times. Uh, this way we can take and send off letters and emails to find their managers, the venue, uh, the people that can get us in contact so we can get uh, media passes in order to shoot the show for a little better vantage point. And first we have to get permission to shoot the show from them. So brainstorming like this at Shorty's keeps us in order so we're able to find out who we're going to talk to for the first six months of the year.